welcome back to this channel mga kwentuan so if this is your first time in my channel and you wanted to be healthy and fit and you wanted to learn as well about financial education then uh, please make sure to click that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that bell icon as well so that you get to be notified of all my videos that i upload every week all right all right so yan so usapang uh, hydroponics uh, system again tayo eh, but this time we're going to talk specifically about uh, Kratky method. So in my previous uh, video about what is hydroponics, uh, I discussed the six types of hydroponic system that is available there uh, in the industry right now. But uh, in this particular video, what we're going to discuss is all about Kratky method. Uh, it's one of uh, a method that is part of yung deep water culture na hydroponics. All right. So um, very quickly, uh, ano nga ba yung background na um, Kratky method? and uh, sino ba ang nag-invento uh, or naka-discover ng method na ito. So basically, uh, very quickly, this was uh, discovered by B.A. Kratky from the University of Hawaii. So that's why the method was named under uh, his name, which is Kratky. Alright? So um, unlike other hydroponic setup or system, si uh, Kratky method, I think at least for my um, experience, and my point of view is the most uh, easiest <laughs> yeah, so most na easiest pa, so redundant but still uh, you get to see the picture why uh, this is very easy to set up unlike other types of hydroponics you need an electrical device or medyo uh, maraming apparatus needed for it to be set up but this one is also somewhat called as a passive system because once you have it installed at hindi siya expensive uh, then uh, your plants will really grow right? So, um, how does Kratky method really works? Okay, so simple lang. So, um, yung Kratky method, um, these are the things that you need. Number one, you need to have a grow box. So, yung grow box can be a form of any, uh, any type of medium that can hold water. Um, and it has to, you have to ensure that the medium or the grow box that you will use is really uh, really has no holes dahil importante that there should be no drip or tulo uh, once you put the water inside because if meron yan siyang tulo then uh, mabilis mauubusan ng water yung uh, plants nyo okay so now aside from uh, the grow box or grow medium you also need to have a pot um, where you're going to have the plants uh, installed Right? So, yung uh, grow pot naman, um, usually, sa mga, if you have a lot of money or you have capital that you can uh, spend, uh, you can buy yung net cups that you can buy online or sa mga stores that sells item, farmer, far, farming items. Yan. Uh, pero kung ano ka naman, uh, wala kang budget na matindi, pwedeng styro cups lang that you can use in... Um, where you can install the plants at, at least for me in my case i'm using yung styro cups lang yung eight ounce na styro cups right uh, one more thing that you need of course syempre is uh yung um, coco choir um itong coco choir talaga ginagamit siya for for this kind of system now if you don't have coco choir you can use also yung mga um styrofoam you also need yung syempre yung water uh, with nutrient solution yan uh, yung nutrient solution marami ng klase ng nutrient solution available right now sa, sa market uh, for me uh, specifically ang ginagamit ko lang would be yung nutrient solution na dinevelop dito sa Pilipinas nila sa may ano sa may UP Los Banos so yun yung nutrient solution na ginagamit ko which is yung snap solution simple nutrient uh, na kinreate ng UP Los Banos of course, um, lastly, pinaka-importante sa lahat, you need the seeds. No? So once you need, uh, once you have the seeds uh, installed, uh, more available, then uh, you're good to go in setting up yung Kratky method. Alright? So those are the things that you need uh, for you to be able to start and install one Kratky uh, system for hydroponics. It's very easy to install and set up. You just need to have the complete items needed for you to 
uh, grow one successful uh, setup. All right. All right. This is an update para dun sa ating lettuce na tinanim nung uh, July 21. Yung green tinanim yan nung July 21. Tinransplant natin. And yung lolo rosa, yung red, tinransplant ko naman yan July 25. So, in about two more weeks, i-harvest na natin ulit. Okay? So, i-update ko ulit kayo mga kakwentuhan dito sa ating project ng lettuce. Okay, so ayan, no? Kita nyo, ang ganda ng mga tubo, no? Alright, so, Kratky Method, Hydroponics. Ayan. Pwedeng-pwede nyo gawin din to sa mga sarili-sarili nyo mga backyard or front yard or any space na meron kayong available. Pwede nyo gawin to kasi don't really need soil for this. Okay? Ayan. Gawin nyo yan siya, mga kakwentuhan. yung update natin sa ating tinanim nung July 21 mga kakwentuhan alright so uh, right now um, August uh, 19 so by Sunday uh, may harvest na natin ito may harvest na natin yung mga lettuce na yan so nakita nyo ang tataas oh tsaka ang lalaki ng dahon oh yan oh kita nyo ang laki ng dahon alright so yan yan ang ano kratki method ng hydroponics Alright mga kwentuhan, so that's it for that video. Uh, I hope you learned something from that and that's what you're looking for. And so if you did learn out from that video mga kwentuhan, please help me share this video to your friend and family para marami tayong matulungan. So if you haven't done so, please click on that uh, thumbs up and share this video. Okay, don't forget to subscribe also. See you again in our next video mga kwentuhan. Bye-bye!